Hi, uh, um, okay, uh, this is your, this is the total board of your project and for your project you need to have two LCD monitors and two mouses and two keyboards also. Actually, I didn't have a second USB keyboard, so that's why I'm using single uh, keyboard to control both these Raspberry Pis and now just turn, on, turn them on by connecting these power banks. Now you can see here these two Raspberry Pis are Okay, now this is the transmitter section and this is the receiver section. First, initially I have only single keyboard, that's why I'm using first controlling the receiver board. You can see here whenever the Linux terminal is open, the Raspberry Pi login here it will ask and just type Pi, those are small letters Pi and press enter. Then you are uh, you will show uh, the Raspberry Pi will show you uh, ask your password and the password is R A S P B E R R I Raspberry and it, but the password doesn't show uh, like in the Windows. Now press enter. Now to use a graphic interface mode, you have to press you have to enter start X S T A R T X. Okay. In this way, uh, you can actually uh, log into your Pi. Now the Pi seems uh, logging in. Then you will have a graphic user interface actually. Now, open LX terminal. Now type command sudo python rx.py. sudo python rx.py. And here is the receiver code actually. Okay, it's working fine. Now remove your keyboard. If you have a two keyboards, then you no need to remove the keyboard. You can actually uh, use it uh, accordingly. And here, the second Raspberry Pi also will prompt for login. And just type Pi. Press password R A S P B E R R Y and password. And similarly, similar to the first Raspberry Pi, just type S T A R T X. Okay. Now the two, two Raspberry Pi's are logged in. Okay. Now I will show you how to uh, send these commands. Okay. Here the receiver section was already done. And from the transmitter side, you have to type sudo python tx.pen. I will uh, text you the complete uh, listings regarding how to uh, send these commands. Okay. Now press enter. Okay. Now you can see here. Enter 0 to 9 and exit. Here, enter 0 to 9 and exit. Okay. Now, see carefully. If I press 1, the two LEDs will turn on and the display will show 1. Okay. Now, if I press 2, then second LED will turn on and two value will be displayed on LCD. Similarly, for 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 0. Okay? If you have any doubts, please let me know. And this is your project. And are you satisfied with this project? Uh, should I need to uh, make any changes regarding? Then please let me know. I will make you uh, as much as comfortable. And the coding was pretty simple. Now I am closing these two Raspberry Pi modules. You can switch off them. But before switching, uh, switch offing this module, I will explain how the code was written for both on the RX side and from TX side. This is the RX, I mean receiver side and for this TX side. Okay. Now gently close it. Okay. Now open this browser file manager file manager then you will have a similar uh, some sort of files like this open i will delete 
I am deleting this. Oh, actually, I didn't have a keyboard actually. So I will explain by simply this RX file. And this is the code for RX file. I think the video was not clear about it. Uh, so I will text you everything, every code of every bit of it, and I will explain you through. If you have a Skype account or Facebook, then just log me in. I will come for video chat uh, once you are free. Okay. Thanks for this video. Hope you satisfied with the project. Thank you.